Hey there everybody, Arlos here from Ice Games, bringing you episode 103 of my Star Wars The Old Republic Trooper with Zeti here, back on Yavin 4, getting ready to uh, kind of figure out exactly what's going on here. We're going to head to the temple courtyard here and uh, uh, figure out what the Revenites have planned. I mean, we, we know they have planned um, to awaken the Empire, and they have some kind of device that's going to be able to, to kill everything on the planet, if not... Uh, a larger area and uh, getting all that kind of force energy will will revive the empire or the emperor somehow so we need definitely need to stop that and uh, I'm kind of excited to figure out how we can do that but uh, before we do that you might notice up here a guild a uh, little logo yes we have a guild for the channel here a uh, very boringly named ice games do you guys have any name suggestions for uh, the republic guild uh, let me know I kind of like um uh, Frozen Empire for the uh, Sith Empire side of things, but we do have a Republic Guild also. Got a few people involved too. Apparently uh, someone else has already taken the leadership role or the leaders for the, the points and stuff like that for Conquest and stuff. So uh, if you guys would like to join uh, the guild, either for the Republic or the Empire side, you guys can either let me know down in the Discord uh, you guys can send me a comment in the description down below of this video, or you guys can uh, let me know with a mail in game. Uh, send it to Zati here, or or Hazraz if you want to join the Empire side, because um, I do have to be on, or someone that is able to invite you has to be on when you get invited. It's not like, or we, they both have to be on, which is kind of annoying. I was kind of hoping maybe they would fix that someday, but they haven't yet, and that's okay. But uh, I'm kind of excited because you do get, I mean, because we're just starting out, we're only level one. You get a couple little bonus, like a reputation bonus of 5%, an XP bonus of 5%. Uh, we unfortunately can't take part in guild invasions and stuff yet because we need a flagship. But good news about that, flagships actually got a lot cheaper. So they used to be 50 million uh, credits, so then I believe it dropped down to like uh, 10 or... Eight, uh, 15 million credits and now it's down to 8 million credits so it's definitely definitely attainable pretty soon uh, which is awesome uh, the only way, thing we need, do need to do is get um, uh, 8 members uh, I've not added anyone since uh, we originally, originally made it but we need to, do need to get 8 members uh, and then we can start a guild bank and with the guild bank I uh, put money in there to be able to uh, buy all the fun stuff and eventually level up and get fun perks uh, for our ship oh my gosh like they look Looks like some of them are, are pretty good, like Flashpoint Mastery, Increased Mastery, uh, went on Flashpoint by 4%. Kind of simple, but hey, 4% Mastery is actually pretty good. Operation Looter, so uh, grants a chance of dropping a small satchel of crafting materials from Operation Bosses while in uh, Guild Group. So, I mean, just little bonuses. I mean, they don't cost too much. Some of them cost, like, a lot. Um, I think this was the most expensive. So increases the durations of adrenals and flashpoints by 30%, which could be quite a bit. Again, you only get them for a few days, it looks like. But uh, hey, you can get those all in all. You can also get some ranks and stuff like that. So I'm pretty excited to uh, get that started up. So again, if you guys want to join me, just let me know. Either comments below on the Discord or in the uh, in uh, in-game mail. Um, we can also edit our heraldry. It's kind of the basic one right now. Uh, mainly I can't quite do that. Well, I mean, I can look at it, but you can't actually update it until uh, we spend a million credits and uh, deposit them into the guild bank. Don't have a guild bank yet, but as soon as we get that going, we will. Um, so that's kind of what's going on with the guild. I'm really, really excited. Uh, thank you everyone that showed up on May 4th, which Uphead 3 said happy May the 4th. It was it was an awesome May 4th for me. I played some Star Wars The Old Republic. I had a few of you guys watching. Uh, I had a few of you guys join me. Uh, so I had... Um, uh, Darth Radinus join, and I had um, X or Night Clone. Uh, Knight also joined me in chat to do some talking. Uh, 797 was in chat. Zach Tester was in chat. A couple of you guys were there. So thank you guys, everyone that uh, showed up. If you guys want to see more streaming like that, I know this it wasn't as exciting because I was more waiting around for people to show up to form the guild that people didn't quite show up to form the guild. But we got we got her started, and uh, that was the important part. Ran a couple of flashpoints with Radinus. Uh, helped. Uh, uh, X clone or night clone sorry um do some some lower level missions uh got a little lost on one of those missions figured it out in the end it was a lot of fun so thank you everyone that uh watched everyone that joined it was a ton of fun and uh honestly um the stream is one of the highly most highly watched videos I've had in a while so quickly uh, which is kind of cool so yeah if you guys ooh, everyone's got their oh two both of you guys have havoc armor that's actually kind of cool um, but uh, we are going to move forward here. 
and uh, head to the temple uh, temple Great courtyard. So again, uh, a pen threes. Thanks for wishing me a happy May Fourth. Happy Thanks May Fourth to everyone, even though it's it's kind of belated now at this point. But hey, we got Star Wars Day uh, in September to look forward to too. Man, so much Star Wars stuff. Um, actually, the day I'm recording this, um, Disney just announced a few more Star Wars movie dates. So it uh, looks like we're gonna get one in 2022. Is it 2022, 2024, and 2026? I believe. Are the dates we're, we're getting another three movies which uh, i'm guessing is gonna be another trilogy i'm not 100 percent sure on that but uh, i'd be okay with that or i would honestly be, be okay with it being three separate movies too maybe one of them being an old republic movie that would be awesome although i do think with disney plus i'm getting way off topic here but disney plus an old republic tv show would be would be a awesome do like um give it a higher budget like a game of thrones kind of uh, idea i think that would be good again pretty good all right, so let's head into the temple here. So let's hop on a mount. Oh, let's actually hop on a mount and don't just hit buttons. What? What, uh, what command level am I? 27. Okay. I don't really know how my trooper here got so much more money and so much more command uh, rank than my um, my Sith. I don't know. Don't know how that all happened, but a uh, little bit ahead. That's okay. Got some stone rays here. Silly little stone rays. Silly little stone rays. Oh, someone's hiding. The I can see you. You can't hide from me in those uh, those bushes. All right. What is the plan here? Go to the temple courtyard. Her temple courtyard is right here. I'm guessing. Oh my gosh! Look at that temple. All right. Act no joke. Okay, the Masasi are no joke. And I need to activate the shards of the first locking mechanism. Four of them. Okay. One, two, three, four. Cool. Easy enough to get to. Easy enough to do. All right. Oh, there's a bunch of Masasi here, too. Let's uh, try to deal with some of these guys. Get down these brutes. That was easy enough. The T... You make it look easy. Why do I have a, do I have a new backpack now? Have I always had that backpack with Havoc Squad? Why am I just noticing it now? Let's, uh... Can I do anything with this yet? Wait for it to respawn. Huh. Why am I just noticing the backpack part now? I'm going crazy. All right, so that's uh, the first locking mechanism down. Gosh, look at this thing. Oh, we got banners over there already. Okay, is that... See, that's what I'm not sure. Like, is that our banners or is that someone else's banners? I'll find out soon enough. Okay, that's two down. Whoop, hello. down these assassin boots here. Easy enough. Done and done. Oh, I love how there's other people running around here too. Definitely makes the world feel a lot more lived in, which is awesome. Like I think there looks like there's 12 people on Masasi here. Well, oh, thanks for the help. Other Havoc Squad member. Alright. I'll wait for this to respawn. While I wait for that to respawn, let's um I'll fight. Let's go let's go fight this big guy over here. This Masasi Crusher. Can I hit him from here? Because that would be awesome if I can. Well, I totally can. Haha. <laughs> oh, never mind. I didn't realize you could just jump right up there like that. Oh boy, okay. Let's uh go here, there. Charge bolts. With a mag bolt. Oh no, I fell down. Ooh, oh, we got a bonus. Defeat Masasi Crushers and Conquerors. Okay. Oh, Conquerors are the... The strong ones. Okay, we got that. We can do that. We can do that. What's up with those, like... I think going through your face there, buddy. Oh, it's like your tendrils below you. Okay. They just they just popped up all funny. Oh, there's a Conqueror in front of me. Let's deal with you. Oh my gosh, look at those Wolverine-like claw things. Oh! Oh boy, that 
that that like javelin thing you threw was bigger than I am. Oh, if I didn't have my armor, that would have just like skewered me in half. It's crazy. Cool, but crazy. All right. Do a mortar strike on these two. Top down a lower one. Oh, I like how you don't have. You don't have the spikes. You do though. Oh. Gosh, yeah. Look at that. Look at how big those spike things are that he's throwing. I'll knock you down, then how about that? That makes things easier for me. Oh, there's another thing up here. Another conqueror. I'll light you on fire. No mortar strike. Oh, that wasn't a mortar strike. That's okay. Oh, get out of the way there. That's four of them down. Just need to deal with one more. There's a third mechanism. Oh, yeah, the fourth mechanism is over here. But I want to try to finish. There we go. There's a conqueror right here. I'll deal with you first. Oh, never mind. Someone else is doing that. I'll take down the Crusher then. There we go. There, bonus objective completed. Uh, let's do some re reload and recharge. Get some uh, health back there. Always a good thing to do after fighting a bigger enemy. Got some brutes over here. That's no, okay. I can knock them over. Ooh, green in the jungle. What is that achievement? Uh, defeat 300 non-player opponents on Yavin 4. Excellent. Oh, did Yavin 4 used to be a PvP planet? Oh my gosh, that'd be crazy. Your arrival has been foreseen. You must press on. All right, my arrival's been foreseen. That's good. Um. Uh... Unless the Emperor saw it also. That would be bad. Because maybe he would want to stop me from doing what I'm doing here. Stop me from stopping Revan. From bringing him back. Looks like uh, I'm headed over here. Hey there, Sergeant uh, Giz. Ancient's Hollow. Right, what's going on in here? We need to disable a second locking mechanism. Just through this area here. Group players. Choice to be entering the other phase or joining an existing phase as a spectator. Nope, I will join do my own phase. Don't have a group right now. Let's see here. Disable a second locking mechanism. Locking mechanism. Rune floors. Rune floors activate matching rune required for locking mechanism. Okay. Let's activate them all. And then shut them all down. We need to touch one of these runes. Alright, you have a rune that looks like that. Is there one that looks like that down here? This one. Touch that one. Does that work? Yes, properly attuned. There we go. So that's the first one down. Put this one over here down. Yours looks like... Big one and a small one. Big one and a small one, like this. Good, good, good. Then grab, touch you again to... Locking mechanism that's properly attuned. See, it feels weird for Zeti to, like, be doing this, because considering she's not force sensitive. Well, I guess she might be a little force sensitive. Kind of have to be. Okay, this one looks blank. Okay. Blank one. None of these ones is blank. Um, oh, maybe I just have to like, try it. So let's try this one. Oh, apparently I, I picked the right one first. Excellent! Go me! Um, my locking mechanism has been attuned. So let's. You're close. I feel it. Excellent. Hurry. Okay, well, we'll do. So let's um, disable the third locking mechanism. Looks like it's out of the cave here. Jump. Back out here. Let's 
cool looking cave here. I like how the the caves a little bit greener than out here side here. Like you can tell the color shift, which well, is kind of cool. Okay, but where we need to go? This way it looks like inside another little cave across the way. Oh no, to the center inside here. Okay, we can do that. Inside this area. Excellent. What's in here? What are we gonna find in here, guys? Some plants. A the sassy guardian. Deal with you, Mr. Guardian. Or not. Put an electro thing on you. Oh, get out of the range of that. There we go, you're down. And uh, let's uh, recharge and reload. Oh, we got another guardian here. Alright. Not to leave some sassy here. I wonder if like is this like a home planet for the the Sith then? If they if they split up somehow, like did the Misassi just like get trapped on this planet and that's how they turned barbaric again, or is this uh is this the home planet of the Sith? Korriban was. You yeah, never know. Can disable the third locking mechanism. Locking mechanism. That cool looking face thing there. Good. You have opened the way. Revan! How is this possible? Through the Force, anything is possible. When the Emperor's followers struck me down, I learned to release my attachments. And who's wearing your mask and leading your followers? I do not know. But I recognize much of myself in him. The darkness I left behind. He must be stopped. His fury will only strengthen the Emperor, not destroy him. Your descendants are close by, Satil and Theron Shan. Why speak to me instead of them? I must remain apart from them. My attachments have always driven me too far, but I've always refused to see it. You must do what I could not. You've done it. The way is opening. I just spoke to Revan. You what? He was there? It was his spirit. He couldn't tell me who's wearing his mask, but he did confirm that trying to kill the Emperor wouldn't work. The man who tortured me was an imposter? How could he know so much? We can sort that out when we face him. For now, we need to focus on the weapon he has primed inside the temple. You're right. We're only going to get one shot at this. Once our forces enter the temple, it's only a matter of time until our friend pulls the trigger. A joint strike committing all of our forces and the Empire's has a good chance of pushing through the temple and disabling the weapon before it can fire. An operation like that needs perfect coordination and trust. It might take some doing to get our troops working together at that level. What about a small unit operation? A small team might be able to infiltrate the temple and reach the device before it can be activated, but... They'll be facing some steep odds. You have led the mission this far. Our victory is within reach. We'll let you decide how best to achieve it. Revan's spirit. Okay, so the person inside there is, is an imposter. That's what I was thinking. All right, so let's open this up. So there have always been a dual nature to the Revan of Legend, le, uh, le, 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 of Revan. I can speak. At its core, or at its core, is he truly a Jedi or is he a Sith? Uh, it has been a hotly debated subject among scholars, politicians for centuries. As one might expect, the collusion, 
conclusions reached by those from republic aligned worlds offered different from those from imperial bent but not always some of the most knowledgeable authorities in the ways of the force believe that it is right to call revan a jedi knight it is also right to refer to him as a dark lord of the sith uh, they contend that the simultaneously uh, knowing and embracing both the light and the dark sides of the force is possible and to and point to revan as potential for proof however Many of these same authorities also believe that such divided adherence would lead unquestionably to madness. All right, so they're saying like um, doing more of a gray Jedi is possible. Well, we'll see. We'll see. I'm, I'm kind of excited to see who's inside Revan's uh, armor there. Let's see. We get some credits, some light side or command points, some light side points, and a dagger here. Let's. We also get a, a new blaster. Oh boy, that is that is cool. Um, kind of like the look of that one, so let's accept it. You know what? I'm going to use it. I'll put you down here, you down here. I'm not actually going to use it as in, like, use it, use it, because it's not quite as powerful. But, I'm going to put it... Oh, I can't put weapons in outfits. Okay. Well, then I'll, um, between episodes I might uh, switch stuff up and, uh, and, and use it. If you guys, what do you guys think? I think I think this one looks pretty awesome. How huge that thing is! Things like bigger than the T here. Love it. All right, so let's uh, hit the map button. We've got to report to the conference table over here, and uh, let's just fast travel there. Make things easier. Bloop. Make things easier to just fast travel. That's not what to do. It looks like we can either do a small strike force or rally the troops. I wonder what's going to be the best way to do this. Hey, another uh, another trooper here. Let's head this way, though. Inside. Let's figure out the best way to do this. The officer, lieutenant, soldiers. All our Republic friends. Except for Satil and Theron and Darth Mar and Lana. Where are those guys at? Well, let's access. All right, guys, again, sorry about the little uh, kind of jump there, but uh, I tried again to see if I could maybe do the operation uh, as I was trying to do with my uh, Assassin uh, Let's Play series, but unfortunately, uh, it's still not the day for the operation, and when I was trying to ask about it in chat and stuff like that, no one really seemed interested. There's not too many people on Yavin 4 right now, so that might be why, but uh, we are going to do this solo, so we have to galvanize the coalition forces, which is probably something that T would want to do anyway. So, again, we could either... The options here, we can either kind of do the do it as an operation, uh, so Raid Revan's Temple, or uh, Solo, where I galvanize the troops and get them to work together. So that's what we're going to be doing. So let's galvanize the troops. Which I'm kind of glad they give you the option there, that, that you don't have to do the operations uh, for part of the story, which is kind of good. Just in case you don't have a group of eight people to play at the time. But uh, hey, I would love, love to do some operations with you guys. I think that could be a lot of fun. Uh, for a guild to do together. Um, so if you guys want to do some operations with me, again, let me know down below. We are playing on the Starforge server. Uh, that's where we are. Um, let's see here. So I have to um, complete multiple mission missions. So we got to galvanize the forces. We got to get them to work together. So you've tracked Revan to his hiding place. It's time to take him down for good. Uh, you've chosen to complete missions that will unite the coalition forces. Uh, you may reset this if I if I want to make the choice again. So that's how I ended up being able to select the Operation 1 and then going back. So I have to do six different missions and defeat these four different commanders. And it looks like one, two, three, four different missions in front of me here. So let's, um, let's talk with you, Lord Rayan. Onward to victory, my friend. Remove the commanders and the rank and file will thrash like a worm out of dirt. Do so in strength, 
and do so in joy. <laughs> Uh, I might not enjoy it as much as, say, you would, but without commanders to oversee them, the Revenite's uh, operations will surely crumble. Scan for Revenite commanders' transmission signals in the Revenite's tents locate, located in the Imperial Guard training ground. Let's scan for the Revenite commander and uh, take them down. Let's see, let's head over here and talk with uh, Lieutenant uh, Sabri. I'm begging you. If you won't hold your fire around the temple, at least remove any artifacts for preservation. I can't do this alone. All right, so there are many ancient Sith relics on Yavin 4 that could shed light on their history and past knowledge. Recover whatever relics you find from the temple ruins. The little training droids we got going, got going on over there. And uh, Sergeant Sager. Hey, you might watch your pace. Speed attracts the wildlife. Any support you can give will take it. All right, so bloodthirsty lurkers are a threat to every operation in Yavin 4's jungles. Kill lurkers in the area, in the open area before the Imperial uh, training ground. So we're going to take out some lurkers. Grab that reward there, too. Yeah. Got to get all that uh, reputation rewards so I can get that sweet, sweet armor. Uh, Colonel Burr. I like you, Captain. You're a freak, and I'd still help if I could. The Imperial Guard knew everything about this world. We should be sharing their data, not hiding it. All right, so the Imperial Guard training grounds computers may contain additional uh, training data that could be useful. Powerful droids guard uh, against outside data access. You'll have to defeat them to complete the download. Let's accept that one. Uh, is there any other missions in this area? Don't see any. So let's start heading out there. Ooh, that armor actually looks kind of cool with that helmet. Is there a way to... Uh... Inspect player. I just want to see what helmet that is. Narshada's crown augmented. That's cool. Oh, freelancer hunter's helmet. That's an awesome helmet. That's cool. I like that. Um, so let's uh, use our transport. Mechanized travel is for official business only. Excellent. Well, let's head down here and then move around. I'm not sure exactly where all the missions are going to be, so we'll figure that out as we go along here. Just give me, just give me one of those walkers. That would make things so much easier. Map here. None around me. That's all right. So let's just move forward here. So I got to take out lurkers. And... Ooh, here's some lurkers. Do these guys count? Let's see. They do not count. Okay. Apparently it's not just any old lurker. Gotta be special lurkers we take out. Um, head through this cave system. Yep, head through this cave. Let's hop on a mount again to make things a little bit quicker. Alright. South Swamp Cave. Alright, ooh, lurkers around here. Maybe within a uh, chopping block over here. Download data. Another general over here. Okay, so let's um try to find some of these lurkers around here. Is there Imperials working together? Some Revenite. Oh, here's some lurkers. There we go. You guys will surely count. Yes. That's we're engaging hostiles. We'll take them down. Ooh, blue item from you. You are holding an armor pierce. Armor pierce. Piece. Pierce. Piece. That looks alright. Put that down there. Just because I'm collecting all the armors I can. I kind of wish Star Wars had a... Ooh, an alpha here. Had a, uh, a thing like Guild Wars 2 where if I got an armor, I could just unlock it. And uh, use it later. Just reskin things. But that's okay. Let's keep all the armors. Which means I need to get more bays to collect more armors. Okay, so that's how many four down. Ooh, we got a general here too. Let's deal with you. Uh, get close enough. Salt plastique. And then mag bolt. And then charge bolts. <laughs> Another mag bolt there. Get some explosive rounds in you too. Or you can even attack us. Okay. Good item from you too. And then we'll have to heal up a little bit. 
take out some more of these lurkers. We got what, 10 more lurkers? Or sorry, six more lurkers to take out. Should probably heal up first, but oh well, we'll do these guys first. Thank you, Dorn. Pull up. Alright, now let's do some healing. Recharge, reload. Two more to take out. Let's head. You know, let's actually head inside here. Wait for those lurkers to respawn if they if they can't. I should grab this uh, junk here. Metallic junk. Let's quickly upgrade my uh, set here. What are we at? 150? Good. Yeah, some of those revenites where we can. Ooh, bonus objective. Take out uh, six revenites for the Scan the Revenite Commander's mission. Okay. Good to know. Marvel's droids. This is a guard console. Oh, this is where we're going to learn some training info. Let's use this. Accessing, 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 downloading guard computer information. Whoop. Deal with these basic training droids. Very basic training droids. Okay, good. The armor. Oh, intermediate training droids. Okay, there's gonna be a group of droids coming out after us. It's like putting the electro net on them. Okay, I got a helmet. Oh, oh, advanced training droid. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. You're almost down. Because Dorn's the best. There we go. Oh, download complete. Okay, we need to download it from the advanced training droid. Good. Let's take all those and recharge and reload. I'm going to take a look. We got a new helmet here. Put that down there. Okay. Um, defeat Revenite droids. So let's try to defeat some droids while we run around and try to take out the commander. Well, let's just take out some of these Revenites when we can. Oh, some combat droids over here. At least one. I feel bad killing them on the ground, but gotta do what you gotta do. Show them no mercy. They would show us none, right? Okay, they're all down. Give me your credits, droid. All the credits I get from you guys will go towards getting a guild ship. You're a combat droid over here. Two more combat droids here. We're gonna have to take out after this. One more, one more combat droid. That bonus mission, which gives me not the lurker one, I want this one. Uh, some command points and some credits. Oh, there's some combat droids over here. Gosh, I love how long range the T is. It's so much easier. There we go. You're down. Oh, I was like waiting for some some type of credits to pop for me. There we go. Let's head this way past these enemies. I don't have to deal with them anymore. I don't think so. Nope. I just got the uh, general Stratton right over here. Er. Straden, Jet General Straden here. Ready, General Straden? Let's do this. Oh, you actually have some cool armor. There are some pretty awesome armors in this game. And I want them all. There we go. General's down. Now let's head over here and try to do some scanning. Let's, uh, I'm gonna rock it. Oh, do you believe? Defeat 75 Revenite forces on Yavin 4. Cool. I like, uh, achievements. And, uh, clearly I don't believe in Revan. 
Let's uh, rocket boost around here then. So let's deal with those guys. Scanning things over here somewhere. Oh, let's take out this uh, cat guy here. Crack jaw. <gasps> oh. Cool. A side mission to take out some Masashi Roamers or Crack Jaws. And there's some Lurkers right in front of me. Oh, that squeal makes me sad, though. I like when the, when the creatures squeal when I kill them. I can feel a little guilty. I have a new mail. Alright. We'll lure out and defeat the Elder Lurker. Um, am I where I'm supposed to be? Back up a little bit here. Use our scanning device thing. What am I scanning for? Oh, you're glowing. Overnight signal transmission. Oh, this must be where the commander is. Okay. Bloop. And. Blow that thing up. Kaboom. There's the Revenite commander himself. Oh, two Revenite Commanders. It's a Revenite Commander himself and a Revenite Commander herself. Okay, we'll deal with both of them. Haha! -ha. Both down. Excellent. Alright, so let's um, do some recharging reloading. And then I'm going to hop on a mount here and head down here. Because it looks like this is where I need to go to defeat the Elder Lurker. Okay, I can do that. Let's uh, hop on a mount. Run past these lurkers. I don't have to fight you guys anymore. Let me deal with you lurkers. I don't know if I can find any more of those cats, so. Or I'm a sassy roamers. Oh, here's a cat. Pew! Does that count? Pew! No? Okay. <laughs> Fortunately, it does not count. Be awesome if I can use that weapon to, uh, to actually attack them. Okay, you're down. Now I just need to find one more. Maybe I can find one on the other side now. Oh, same walker. Cool. Trying to pass these uh, lurkers. I don't have to deal with them anymore. It's a lurker alpha. Gotta go down here to deal with the big one. Oh, you found a cat. See if I can find another one here. Or a Masassi Roamer. Excellent. One or the other works. Get those bonus objectives in. Those extra command points. There. Oh boy, I had to move out of there quickly, but uh, thankfully Dorn finished them off. Pop another mount. And then head inside here. We're out. Elder Lurker. Okay. And I got some more commanders to take down. And a couple more. Oh, I guess it, it doesn't count me finishing the mission until I hand it in, eh? Okay, that's fine. Oop, pile of bones. Searching, searching, searching. That's some huge skulls there. That must be some big Masassi skulls. Oh my gosh! Here we go. An Elder Lurker. Deal with you. Mag bolt. Charge bolts. Light you on fire. Oh, you're dead already. Never mind. Never mind, I don't have to light you on fire. Let's up the map here for a second. The other guy's over here. Can I fast travel over there? And fast travel to the temple ruins the outside. Let's do that then. Get our fast travel on. One well, of my th favorite thing about being a subscriber is you can carry more money and uh, you can fast travel and stuff like that. So this is where you would go if you wanted to do the operation. Fortunately, again, I can't do the operation right now because there's no one here. Um, 
Oh, you're a taxi. Is there a... Oh, this is where you can get some extra missions and stuff for the uh, uh, operation. What is it? I eventually will do, guys. I promise I'll do the operations. I think that could be a lot of fun. Let's see here. Um, because I don't think those missions will count because they're operation missions. They won't count towards doing this. Let's see here. Cover relics. Okay, let's recover some relics. And get a commander there to take down and a commander there to take down. Okay. These must be... Okay, these are the relics here. These. Good. Well, I'm probably going to take out some sassy on, the, sassy on the way there. Ooh, actually I actually have a bonus mission to take out 15. Should we do that nice and easy like? Take that, Mr. Sassy Brute. Alright, you're down. Let's grab the thing. And is it just oh just Masassi in general? Okay, so it doesn't have to be brutes. Or like the strong ones, the last one was. <laughs> We're gonna made at you. Run away! No, I don't wanna get hit. There we go, that's good. Conquer it down. Grab this one. So I need six. That'll be number two. And three and four. What do you have for me? Ooh, some more reputation. Got three of those now. That's good. Definitely want to get all the reputation we can. What is our reputation with them right now? Reputation. Coalition forces. We are currently an outsider about to become a new hummer, newcomer. I think we need to get the hero to buy that armor that I want from here, though. So I may have to do some grinding eventually. But that's okay. Actually, do you guys have, like, a favorite armor you think would look good on one of my either my trooper or my, uh, my assassin? Or is it T or Hosras? I'd love to hear from you guys. I think she'll just get all the armors. Okay, that's 7 out of 15. Eight more still. That's rocket boost towards some of them. Bunch of here. Dueling the Masassi. Uh, defeat 75 Masassi on Yavin 4. Been there, done that. Ooh, more reputation, I like that. I got four more Masassi to take out. Target is dead, I know. I want to target this target. I think that was Conqueror. Excellent. Grab another relic. I have three more enemies to take out. Thankfully, there are three enemies. Oh, there's four enemies right here. Oh, I'll take them all out. Why not? They're definitely, definitely on the evil side of the spectrum. There we go. Bonus objective completed. Let's grab this relic right here. So that'll finish off that mission. Awesome. And then we have... So that's what? One, two, three, four missions done. We got ourselves a commander right here. Oh, let's attack you from above. Haha, <laughs> attacking from above! Oh, you have the blaster pistol, so it's not gonna help out very much. Oh boy. Okay, you're down. Good. Take all. Let's see here. Is there. I don't want to look at vendor. Missions? So I'm missing two missions over here. Unknown. Is that unknown over here? Oh, it's a mission. Okay. Oh, the Sergeant uh, Gez. Gez? You. If we don't get massive support soon, we're all dead. And I didn't sign up to get eaten. So, vicious stone rays continue to harass coalition forces in the Yavin 4 jungles. Kill stone rays in the jungle area between the training grounds and the temple ruins. Take 15 of them out. Okay, let's accept that. I can do that. Sitting there's some stone rays right here. Good 
15 of them to defeat. Make sure that me know Dorn. We take them out already. And there's some over here too. Oh, there's another mission it looks like too. Down here. Galactic Rampage Part 1. I'm kind of excited to figure out exactly how all this Galactic Rampage stuff works. Uh, so, I know some of it, I haven't really been dealt with a lot of it because I know some of it has to deal with expansion stuff, but it feels like, so I finished Galactic Rampage Part 1. Um, so I got some credits and some campaign, uh, command points for that, and I've got 476 points. If I get 15,000 points, then I'll get these credits and the 2,000 command points, which is quite a bit of command points, actually. Um, and then you also get, like, these crafting materials. And, like, these ones are repeatable daily. So I could do Galactic Rampage Part 1 again every day. Um, some of them are, like, a huge amount. Like, this one's 3,570 points. I get that from completing the Operation Scum and Vill Villainy on any difficulty mode. Uh, this for Operation Golden Fury. Uh, complete the weekly Galactic Starfighter missions and stuff, some PvP stuff. So, I mean, I mean it's something I'll do maybe after I, I finish the Revan uh, expansion. I might take a look at some of that stuff more. That's that's that stuff. That stuff a little bit in more detail. We got a lot. So let's look at this data pad. Hunters hunted. Uh, Viridian squad reconnaissance update. Sergeant Era Jung. Uh, commanding? Well, that didn't work out. The Masasi were on us as soon as we left the drop zone. Uh, they didn't watch from the shadows, or they don't watch from the shadows anymore. Uh, we're their new favorite prey. The team went down fast. Survivors got dragged in the direction of the Masasi village. Uh, enemy must have assumed the hole in my gut had killed me. Uh, if you're reading this, my one woman rescue attempt ended badly. Sorry to disapp disappoint you, Major Tasso. Uh, you always said a rich girl like me shouldn't be in charge. Guess you win the argument by default. Oh. Um, I've got a mission here, so let's accept that. Uh, what's the mission? To rescue Republic Scouts. Oh, which are here. Okay. Well, let's see if we can find some more. You know what? Let's rescue the Scouts. Oh, nope. we got some more Stone Rays over here, so let's start dealing with them. we got a bunch more of those guys to take out. And I miss them completely. Ah, it's so hard to see the circle sometimes. That's 9 out of 15. 10 out of 15, so only 5 more. Good. Let's head in here. I wonder if we got a mission to take out some of the Masasi. Let's find out. I like myself some bonus missions. Ye yes. Yeah, defeat 10 Masasi. Okay, defeat 10 Masasi here. Cool. This is their little village area. Evolutionarily speaking, the Masasi are fascinating. They were genetically altered from Sith, then naturally adapted to the jungle. Pity they weren't consent to a study. <laughs> oh, Dorn, always wanting to know the signs of things. Masasi freaks killed my buddies. They're not killing anymore. All right. Oh, I'm saving Republic Scouts. Good. Oh, no. Oh. Well, that's probably why you're called an imp. <laughs> it literally took me two seconds to, to kill you. Knock you down. Six Masasi down. Don't know how you found us. Back at base. Drinks are on me. Ooh, excellent. I like for don't run into the Masasi, you fool. Oh, maybe you a stealth thing. He disappeared. Let's pretend that's what happened. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Alright. Only got a couple more to take down. And three more to rescue. You saved my life. We were dead. And you... <sighs> Thank you. You're welcome. I do my job. I do it well. They were gonna kill us. I don't know how. I don't even know why. Because we're different. That's why. And we're technically invading their, their planet. <laughs> so they're kind of... You, you can justify that they're defending themselves a little bit. Okay, I want to take out one more. Ooh. Oh, that's a general. Okay. Oh, a Canthar general. 
Yes, uh, the Revenites take all forms, right? Take down the imps. Oh. oh, and another Watcher here. We did finish off the bonus protector, which is great. Okay, so let's rescue you. I can make it back to camp. Stay strong out here. Will do. All right, save everyone. Oh, do we have? Oh, some metallic junk inside this bin. Scavenging is now 156. Okay, we gotta head into which tent was it? Was it this tent? Yeah. Okay, and take out Master Zunor. Oh, you are a. Oh! That's the color of your lightsabers. You got that black stuff around the edges of it. Ah, it's always so cool. Kind of like the bolts I have, which is black in the middle and then yellow on the outside. We took you down. Okay, that's all the commanders. So I still have to take out 10 stone rays. Let's hop on a mount here. Head back over here. Gosh, lots of people doing this mission. I like that. I like to see so many people in... Uh, whoop! Camera messing up in Star Wars. There we go. We're down. That's 14 down. Just one more. Just one more. It's rocket boost. Oh, I mean, we'll take out a couple more here. Yes. Before they could even get to me. Maybe. Yeah, before they can even get to me. Haha. <laughs> oh, gosh, I do love the explosive rounds being able to knock down weak enemies there. Lure, lure out and defeat the Stone Ray Matriarch. Where are you? Oh, you're right over here. Okay. Oh, and we're recover the ancient relic. That's another mission I need to do. Ignite this. I'm going to burn your nest. That'll make you come out there. Don't worry, Matriarch. Let's light you on fire a little bit. See how you like fire. Haha, <laughs> not, not at all. Alright. Ooh, pants. You had pants in your beak. Pants go down here. What does this helmet look like, too? I mean, I do not, I'm not the biggest fan of this helmet. I don't know why. Maybe you could look it on someone. Not sure who, though. Uh, I gotta head back to this cave I was in before. To see who it was. Or to see where this um, ancient relic is. Oh, I gotta talk with you. Let's talk with you, because I just killed that matriarch. Wildlife is under control for now. You'll have room to maneuver. Right. Yes, sir. Good. So we got some more... Um, Reputation trophies, some light side points, some command points, and some credits. So that's what I like to see. Though, I don't really know what light side points give me now that I'm 100% light. Don't know uh, if that gives me a bonus at all. Well, it's rocket boost. Again, I do love my rocket boost. See, it's down here. Oh, another group phase over here. Okay, good. Hey, Sith Spirit. How's it going? Entering story area. Ancient altar. Oh, those are daily missions, too, so you can repeat them every day if I wanted to to get more reputation points. Here they come. Get a big uh, ancient Masasi rinth mirror. Or however you'd pronounce that. Thank you, Dorn, for uh, being his little punching bag for now. Thank you. Ooh, you went down pretty easy, actually. And an ancient relic. Return to Lieutenant Sabri. Now, are all of them... Yeah, they're all around here. So let's just quick travel back to our main base. And uh, figure out what I can do. Or just hand these off and uh, be done with the mission. Hopefully, there might be something else we need to do. Okay, so let's talk with you over here, Lieutenant Sabri. One of these relics preserved. 
consider it done. Thank you. I'm glad someone in the Republic doesn't need our whole history purged. Oh, you're an Empire character. Okay. So let's accept that. And then head over here. Ooh. Talk to the sergeant here. I've been the pack. If you're gonna secure a beachhead, now's the time. Understood. I'll call it in. Maybe we'll see more action than fangs and claws after all. All right, let's accept that. Talk to Major. So. were captured by Masasu. I freed the survivors. Their commander left a message. Uh, Sergeant Chung dead. Blasted. I'll put her in for a commendation along with her men. Oh, good. Oh, command ranked up too. Awesome. Talk this to you, Colonel Burke. Guards training data. It should help both sides. I won't tell my superiors if you won't. Like it or not, we're in this together. Good, good. I'm glad people are starting to work together here, so let's accept that. Uh, we got one more to drop off here. So five out of six missions. Excellent. You were right. The Revanites rely too heavily on their commanders for direction. Ah, oh, how wonderful to hear. I so hope the Republic will celebrate victory with us before the knives must be unsheathed. Oh, again, I'm, I'm glad everyone's everyone's getting getting to, getting to along pretty well right now. Now we need to report to the conference table. But again, we know as soon as after, as soon as we destroy the Revanites, uh, they'll have to be back at each other. So, like, I mean, people working together now could be uh, fighting each other on a battlefield later, which kind of sucks. Right, does he? If only the whole galaxy could get along together, that would be good. Are we ready? All teams report ready. You've done very well. All of the soldiers here look up to you. Imperial and Republic both. Let's proceed. All units, move out. All units report success. The weapon has been shut down and all Revanites neutralized. Only one more left to deal with. Ivan told us where Revan might go. The Emperor's final sanctuary. We've got speeders prepped. You won't be facing him alone. I'll take all the backup I can get. Let's move. All right, so now, with everyone working together, I love that little little cutscene thing they showed. We said travel to the Forgotten Terrace. And uh, travel to the Forgotten Terrace and face Revan. Take Revan down for good, or I guess now that we know it's not Revan, whoever's in Revan's armor. But uh, before we do that, let's uh, take a look and see what we got this mission. So we got some reputation points. Uh, let's see if that's going to get us anywhere near um, friends. So let's use the big one first. All right, we're a newcomer now. Oh, these are going to take a while. I'll do these off off camera, just so you don't have to watch me hitting that button a whole bunch of times. Um, a command crate tier one, because they're clearly not going to get us a friend. Although we get the new title unifier from that, that'd be cool. Definitely think Raven's Bane would be a cool title. But let's uh, let's see what we get in our command crate tier one. Uh, so let's open it up. Yes, I'm sure. All right. Ooh, some new boots. Oh, those actually look kind of cool. I don't mind those. Uh, we got ourselves a new, uh, some new armor. Definitely not uh, Zeti looking, but uh, that would work for a uh, Sith, that's for sure. Uh, Dorm, we can no influence that from that, but someone else might. Uh, some crafting materials and some command tokens. So let's claim all. There we go. How are we doing for command tokens? Currency 130. I don't know what to spend those on, but we'll figure that out later. You go down here. Yeah, the Eternal Commander. Mark II Eliminator's boots. boots. Okay, put those down here too. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this episode here, guys. So thank you guys so, so, so very much for watching. Oh, apparently I have to go back inside here to uh, travel away. Okay, <laughs> I'll do that next episode. So thank you guys again so much for watching. Don't forget if you like what you see, that, hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys don't like what you see, you can hit that dislike button too. And if you guys would like to join me in Star Wars The Republic, remember to send me a message either in-game 
on the Discord or in the comments below. And I'll uh, talk with you and try to find a time that we're able to uh, meet up in game so I can invite you to the guild. That could be a lot of fun. Uh, I'm definitely planning on having um, some guild events pretty soon um with with everyone joining maybe maybe um in a little while after we get more people uh we can kind of figure out what time everyone's kind of on uh that could definitely work out and um yeah i want to get get a guild ship i think that could be pretty awesome and until next time though guys keep your stick on the ice